Hello friends, my name is Pratibha Divedi and I am working as assistant professor at Biani group of colleges. I welcome all of you on behalf of gurukpo.com. Today I am going to present a video lecture on the topic of chemotaxis in bacteria. At first what is chemotaxis? Chemotaxis is a movement of an organism in a specific direction in response to a particular chemical stimuli. This uh, st uh, chemotaxis depends on the signaling pathway which ultimately terminates on the fl flagellar motor motion. The flagella in bacteria move in a rotatory fashion and this rotatory fashion may be of two types uh, clockwise rotation or counterclockwise rotation. In clockwise rotation bacterial cell forward motion and seizes and cells tumble while in counterclockwise motion uh, counterclockwise rotation bacterial cells moves forward motion it means it runs. The flagellar motor proteins are of three types mot A, mot B and, uh, and flea G. These proteins create a proton channel which ultimately drives the flagellar motion. How does a bacterial cell work in the presence of a chemical gradient? In the presence of a chemical gradient, if the chemical is in attractant in nature, the cells moves in direction of high concentration of the, that chemical. And if this chemical is a repellent, the cells will move in opposite direction or vice versa the uh, attractant. In the absence of chemical gradient, cells moves in randomly fashion, it means cells run freely and tumbles freely. The, res the, response, uh, uh, the response in increased concentration of uh, uh, increased concentration of chemical is uh, only a transient. It means the response is stable is only for a few seconds. It, it is transient because cells adapt in increased stimuli and this adaption is mediated by methylation of MCPs. MCPs are methyl accepting chemotaxis proteins which are transmembrane proteins present on the cell of a bacterial cell. These methylations are catalyzed by the protein which is key R protein. It is methyl transferase in nature. It transfer the methyl group from the to the MCPs and methylate the MCPs so that the cells will adapt to the increased stimuli of the chemical. Now what is the mechani molecular mechanism behind the chemotaxis in bacterial cells? At first when a repellent molecule bind to the chemotaxis receptors present on the membrane of the bacterial cell, these chemotaxis uh, receptors are transmembrane proteins present in the cell membrane of the uh, bacterial cells. These chemotaxis receptors are also known as methyl accepting chemotaxis proteins which are uh, known as MCPs. The, the binding of repellent to the chemotaxis receptor cause the binding of adapter protein to this receptor. The adapter protein KW bind to the chemotaxis receptor and then it will increase the phosphor binding of KA protein which is a sensor protein. It, is also, it also have a histidine kinase property. It means it auto phosphorylate on the histidine poly, amino acid of this protein. Histidine phosphorylation of KA causes the phosphorylation of KY protein. The phosphorylated KY remain only for a few second and the KJ protein uh, catalyzes the uh, dephosphorylation of KY protein which is a response regulator protein and cells undergo again in the forward motion type of movement. This is the chemotaxis in bacteria. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, comment, share and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and visit our website gurukpo.com.